All right, today we're at Aspen Highlands for another installment of How You Ski It. We're gonna ski Snyder's Ridge today. Love this run, starts off with some bumps and then it's gonna get really, really steep. Here we go, let's do this. Snyder's Ridge is named after Tom Snyder, who was a ski patroller. Tom lost his life alongside Chris Kessler and Craig Soddy. All three of them died in an avalanche in 1984 doing avalanche control up on the Highlands Bowl. We're gonna go right down the ridge on Snyder's Ridge in memory of Tom Snyder, who it's named after. All right, so we just came down the steep section of Snyder's Ridge. It spits us out onto Sodbuster, but what we're gonna do is stay to our right a little bit and try to stay on top of the ridge. And we're gonna go from open steeps to some tightly gladed trees. Here we go. If we get down Snyder's Ridge, you can see we're gonna, we're gonna stay on the ridge here. We can drop off to the right or the left, but if we stay on the ridge, it's typically pretty good snow. So there's two ways to exit out of Snyder's Ridge. Um, the catwalk, we showed you guys that. It's, you know, probably the easier of the two ways. Or stay on Sodbuster, another thousand vertical feet of moguls and trees. That's what we chose. Took us down to the bottom of the deep temerity lift. And then now we're riding the 2,000 feet vertical out of deep temerity back to the top of Aspen Highlands. Mm -hmm. 